Howdy mates, this is the Dell 13. Welcome to the Yad Geshwada 13 tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you the art of dive bombing. I have forgotten in the first one where to always engage your field pumps before start and to keep your radiators fully open at all times. Like this. Now, before the start of the Stuka, you might want to decrease your sight altitude to the possible. The sight altitude affects how you bomb. The higher the setting, the sooner your aircraft will. If you have it on lowest setting possible, it will be up to you when you drop the bombs. I'm going to be bombarding a nearby village of Central Base. I'll make my dive from about 1500 to 2000 meters. Okay, also missing my attack run. So now to explain you how to do the dive bomb. First things first, you have to be right on top of your target in order to even enter a dive. Of course, if you want to. Secondly, there are two ways to enter the dive. 
either you just plop open the die brakes and push her nose down into a 90 degree nose dive or you first roll her onto your onto the back and then pull back on the stick to lead her into the best approach is to simply plop the dive brakes and lead her into a dive but where's the interest in that? of course it's in, uh, easy and cost effective but isn't as cinematic so I'm going to show you the second way and dive and if you are targeting a moving target it's, it's speed and your bombs otherwise you may miss your target completely you want to watch your angle of attack you have to take bombs ballistics into consideration if you f dive in anything other at any other angle than 90 degrees to the ground before you even think about commencing your uh, bombing run make sure that you have your bombs armed Otherwise, they will go down, never explode. And as for the targets, I think I see some pretty juicy targets down there that I can attack. I think I'm gonna try my hand with either the hangar or the radar or that whatever it is down there. So, let's see what I can do. Direct hit. Also note to always close your dive brakes immediately after dropping the bomb. Otherwise you are risking your wings to be ripped off. So with that said, let's return to first airfield and land. See about this landing approach.
give myself a solid 5 out of 7 for this touchdown. Definitely could be better. Enjoyed and enjoyed this video and found it helpful. I'll see you guys around. Bye.